So I wanted to demonstrate how I troubleshoot um, some issues with this calculator. Um, specifically this button, the on button, and the six keys right here. The problem is in these calculators, these older calculators, the contact um, isn't good so here, isn't so good right here. Um, so a, a little pressure has to be applied in this area to get it working. So for instance, if I push here, I can do the on and on, but on and off button. But once I let go, it no longer works. See, can't turn it on. So one trick I found is to apply a little pressure in this area in sort of a twisting motion. And it's a rugged calculator, so it's, it, it can take that. But at this point, I can turn it on and off, and those, that key's working fine. The problem now is when I do the add, addition, subtraction, any of these keys, they no longer work. They still no, no longer work. So what happens is you need to, pressure needs to be applied here. So what I'd like to do is to um, use a rubber band. So I've also used a cable tie. And this is a really beefy calculator. So. At this point, I can use the operator keys. Six, six plus zero is six, minus six is zero, um, times four is zero, divided by seven is zero, the back key works, and the uh, one over x key works. So at that point it's, it's working fine. So, like I said, I can also use a cable tie around this area, um, but that's how I get it working. At this point, we're good. We can, all the keys work. The calculator is fully functional, and it's you know it's not it's actually a pretty good to keep it stable, even though it does have the rubber feet. It's just a little bit, a little more contact on the table.